This is love, the story of Easter. Today, Jesus washes his friends' feet. Hi friends, welcome to Blackhawk Kids. My name is Kelsey, and I'm really excited to hang out with you today. Before we take a look at today's Bible story, let's spend a little time talking to God first. Dear God, Thank you so much that you love us and you want to be our friend forever. In your name we pray, amen. Let's get ready to praise God with some singing and dancing before we hear our Bible story. Stand up. Let's move and sing to God. is helping me I can do the things that he does I can love like Jesus I believe his light can shine through me I can do the things that he does I can love like Jesus story of Easter is all about love. The love Jesus has for you and you and you and you. Jesus came to be a friend to everyone forever. Jesus showed us what it looked like to love one another through his life on earth. Our story today happens four days after Jesus arrived in Jerusalem riding on a donkey. He was going to share a meal with his closest friends, the disciples. Before they ate, Jesus did something really special to show how kind and loving he is. Let's watch this true story from the Bible found in Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John. Here we go. Just follow me through. Hoo, hoo. Follow me through, follow me through. Hola friends, I'm Luis the Handyman. So happy to see you today. Check out this car. It belongs to my friend Arturo. I'm helping him fix it because the wheels aren't working. Oh, <laughs> and that's what you do to be a good friend. You help them. In fact, that reminds me of a story. You wanna help me build it? <laughs> Great, let's put it on the story fence. Hammers up, little builders. Ready? Uno, dos, tres, hammer. Great job, little helpers. You can put your hammers down. Now, we just need our story tools. Yep, we have everything we need. Okay. 
So today's true story from the Bible begins with Jesus. It was the night he had all his friends, the disciples, with him at dinner. His friend John was there, and Matthew, and Peter. They all were at the table. Then Jesus took a towel and knelt down by his friends. Do you know what Jesus was doing? He was about to wash his friends' feet. His friends had been walking around dusty roads all day and their feet were dirty. <laughs> Everyone say, ew! Ready? <gasps> ew! <laughs> yep, talk about a stinky job. Ooh. Now, we need to fill up the bowl with water. Can you guys take your pretend buckets and help me fill the bowl with water? Ready? One, two, three. Ah, good job. <laughs> now, Jesus has water. Then, Jesus washed his friend's feet. Huh. Can you believe that? Jesus is so important. He is God's son. Why would someone so important wash his friend's feet? Hmm. Because he wanted to show his friends that he loved them. And you're never too important to love others by doing something for them, like washing their feet. Everyone say, wow. Ready? Wow. Jesus is a good friend. <laughs> hmm. Let's think for a minute. If we wanted to be a good friend like Jesus, what could we do to show love to other people around us? What if you're playing outside and your neighbor friend wants to play on your favorite scooter? Do you let them? <laughs> yes, you share your favorite scooter. That is being a good friend. What if there's a long line to get a turn in the bouncy house, but there's a little kid behind you who's really excited to bounce? Do you let them go in front of you? <laughs> yes, you let them go in front of you. That is being a good friend. You already know lots of ways to be a good friend. So start your engines and let's go, go, go and love people like Jesus did. So let's be good friends. Hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who can love like Jesus? I can love like Jesus. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who can love like Jesus? I can love like Jesus. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Adios. Jesus is the best friend ever. He wanted to show his friends, the disciples, how much he loved them. So he washed their feet. Washing someone's feet was a very kind thing to do because people who lived when Jesus lived wore sandals and had very dusty feet from walking outside. What Jesus did was very surprising. Why would Jesus, the Son of God, wash his friend's dirty feet? Because Jesus came to earth to show people what love is. Loving others like Jesus means showing them you care by helping out, by being kind, and by being a friend to everyone. Sometimes that means helping out even when you don't feel like it. Jesus was a good friend to his disciples, and he is a good friend to you too. Jesus came to be your friend forever. He loves you today, tomorrow, and every day after that, forever. Let's celebrate that Jesus is our friend forever. Stand up. It's time for our Bible verse. We've been practicing some words from the Bible that teach us about God's love. Are we only love today? No, God loves us forever. Let's say Jeremiah 31, three all together. And don't forget, we start with a big hug. Ready? Go. I have loved you with a love that lasts forever. Jeremiah 31, three. Great job. I feel a lot of love in here. Let's practice it again, but this time say it in a teeny tiny 
squeaky mouse voice. Here we go. I have loved you with a love that lasts forever. Jeremiah 31 3. Amazing job. Remember that Jesus loves you every day, and that's why he came to be your friend forever. Let's move and sing to God. Jesus is my